Hi guys, Cody the gang. How are you doing? John here again. Just thought I'd send you a quick, quick upload of coronavirus. We've all been sat in for now four weeks. It's driven me fucking mad. Sorry about that, but that's the way it is. A friend of mine just came out of uh, HMP Bullingdon, and he says that uh, everybody's banged up. It's like 23 hour bang up. So I can imagine what that's like. Staff afraid to come near you. That kind of stuff. You know, I, I suppose there's more, there's more rules and laws being broken in prisons now than prisoners could have ever have broken. And like I've always said, prison punishment, apart from murder, is the worst uh, inflict it's the worst uh, pound of flesh they can get back out of you. You know, whatever you've done, prison isn't the fucking answer. You know, that prison is, is 20 times the punishment, you know. Because you get prison, you get fines, you get this, you get that. Oh, it's just, it's a, it's a nightmare. That's why I'm staying out of the... I, I'm just an ex-offender now, I don't bother with it. But I do support uh, all you guys out there. Who are trying to earn a living? You got big families. You got no money. Well, you got to do what you got to fucking do, ain't you? Of course, I don't approve of violence, old people, that kind of shit. That's you know, you shouldn't be doing that. Nobody should be doing that. You know, it's just out of order. But you know, we've all stuck together. I've never seen cues like it to get into the chemist, stuff like that. On a lighter side, at least uh, Prince Bloody Harry and Meghan, Meghan Mar Markle, not that I, I, I'm not racist, I, I quite like the girl, she's alright. Apparently she's a bit bossy, but they're slagging old Donald Trump off. Now I don't mind Donald Trump, I think he's alright, you know, well, you know, each for own. But um, they've slagged him off so much. They slag the geezer off so much and they go to America and they expect him to pay for their fucking security, four million pounds a year. Well, bollocks to them, you know. And these people got some cheek. They sit and slag you to fuck and then expect him, him to pay their security, you know. Oh, I, I'm glad he, you know, he was less than pleased with them. Anyway, respect to you people. You're all good. Yeah, that was um about it. I am going to do some more regular um updates of uh, my struggle with coronavirus. Um, I can appreciate many, many, many people have been affected in different ways by losing people. I'm actually a carer for my elderly mother, and I'm so fucking pleased. I mean. Another member of my, our family wanted to put her in care. And I'm fucking pleased that she didn't go into care. Because she'd have probably be dead by now, wouldn't she? Poor woman. So, you know, as long as I've got a hole in my ass, then I can assure you of one thing. Sorry about that. I can assure you of one thing. That, you know, she'll be well looked after. I'm not knocking people in, in... Well, I am fucking knocking people in care. I'm just, I am. Fucking stupid, horrible, murdering cunts. Going and leaving them to die. It's horrible. You know. I don't care if I get knocked for it. But, you know, you, you don't leave people... Human beings, just because they're old, to die. You know. I just wouldn't, you know... It doesn't the bloody droplets get in your eyes or, you know, there's, there's ways around it. Anyway, respect to uh, Cody and all the followers, including Dan in America. <laughs> all right, Dan, how you doing? Uh, respect to all you guys. And um, I will see you soon. I'm going to make some more of these vlogs. Anyway, guys, respect. <laughs>